Hi, it's Malcolm here and welcome to another PR ratings video or update video. So in this video, we're going to discuss the green rated 0 to 3, UK only and weekdays and how you can use those to create better systems. So stay tuned. Hi, as I said, it's Malcolm here, and if you don't know me, I've been creating products for the betting markets for over 20 years, and, and PR Ratings is a piece of software that allows you to analyze racing data, in some cases going back as far as 2015, and create your own systems, and with that you get links to your daily selections and you're able to save them. So, in this video, what I'm going to do is show you the updates and I'm going to use what we call a shared system, which is here. These are shared saves that other members have shared with us so that we can have a look at them, change them, look deeper into them, use them, whatever you want. And we're going to use Mark's TTS system here, which I've already loaded in. And as you can see, it's only got um, eight months worth of results and the reason for that is one of the new ratings which is this green rated here which I only started putting in the database eight months ago so that's why we've only got that much information but it's turning out to be quite an interesting rating so where does a green rating come from well I'll show you that because it's um, it's interesting to know and it actually comes from another piece of software that I have it's which which is called TTS so on TTS you can see that you, you've got these green colors here so they represent the top ratings for each of those columns and there's a maximum of six so this run has got four this run has got six which in some cases not the great thing Great is because there's not a lot of information about these races, but generally if you use handicaps and things like that, you get a good idea about the, how good the ratings are. So we're looking for something between zero and six. So that's how we come up with that rating. Okay, so um, Mark's used it in, in this um, particular system and, you know, it's done okay. Um, last month wasn't particularly great, but... Um, we will see how that goes. Now, the next update, so we've added the green rating filter and there's a, quite a few systems popping up with that in there. So it's quite um, handy to look at. But we've also, with the PR ratings before, there were two separate versions. There was an Irish version and a UK version. And that was because originally I started the UK version. And I wanted PR ratings to be mainly for UK racing, actually. Um, I'm not a great fan of Irish racing. It's just it's I can't get all the ratings that I can get for um, UK racing. So some of the, some it makes it a little bit difficult. And so some of my ratings don't cover Irish racing anyway. But you'll know that because it will either pull them up or not. But it was we actually added this separate version, um, which um, allowed you to analyse Irish races, of course. Um, but I decided that it was about time I merged the two together. So now I've added them together um, into one. And so now you can choose between UK, UK and Ireland and Ireland only. So for example, if we add UK and Ireland and activate it, and as you can see, it's turned green. And in this system now, you'll see actually done a little bit better last month. The... Um, the Irish races did actually help and if we took Irish only um, and if you just before we do that just take keep an eye on um, longest losing runs and points profit and stuff like that just so we see and the Roy um, we can see kind of how it affects it so if we come back down and as you can see 32 points 33 Roy two losing runs so as a little system it's not too bad, but it does work, work better, obviously, with both of them. And so that would be where I would probably set that system up. OK, so that's two of the, um, the new features. The third one is we I have added weekday. Now, with, um, with PR ratings, you've always been able to look at each individual weekday. But if you come down, you'll see that there's these yellow tick boxes and there's already these buttons already selected anyway so say I wanted to 
just check green, green ratings for the point we've, we went zero to three so if I update the software you can see now I've got green, green rated TTS which is basically what that green rating is now if I want to quickly find out where the profit is all I do is click that okay and it tells me that zero so runners without any um, green rating at all created 90 points um, with one 80, um, 15 and with two 25 and you can see that the different strike rates and things like that so you could like narrow the system down if you wanted to you could go for a better strike rate um, or you could go for more profit and you could see how that affects it by then going so let's just go to O and um, I will say that this is a quick analyze so it is a kind of rough calculation so it's not always totally 100% um, accurate when you do the proper um, thing but it's not often far out but you can see it's a little little bit out I think uh, 90 points to 89.95 and you can see that um, so just O on its own made a lot of that profit and it still didn't do very well last month so um, you can decide whether you just want to use that or, or look at the others as well now I'm going to put that back quickly we in my uh, daily emails and if you want to know how to get onto my daily email just put a comment um, in the, uh, below saying um, tell me about emails or get me on the email or something like that and I'll show you a link to where you can get on the daily email and I discuss systems um, ideas updates that kind of thing every day um, so that's one thing and actually um, I also give away a system and if you want that just say give me system in the comments below and I'll, I'll do that as well um, as soon as I get a chance I go through the comments and add that so there's a couple of ways you can get more information about PR PR so more information about PR and um, free system please free system please so if you want to do them both you can do them both I don't really it doesn't matter to me I just um, uh, if you want the information just just put a comment below and I'll be more than happy to um, give you the links to that information okay so in my daily email we've been talking about days of the week now obviously it's a bit weird saying oh don't bet on Saturdays or don't bet on Sundays and people even say you know don't bet on Mondays it's a mug's day or something like that um, and a lot of people will say well that's variance you know you can't you know the difference between Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday and Friday shouldn't be any but that's not I think entirely true because you do get different um kind of races during the week and there's always a build up to the weekend and that kind of thing and then Saturdays you've got a lot of punters that don't bet in the week so that could affect prices who's favorite and things like that in some cases there could be something in choosing days of the week and I have seen systems that definitely have odd days and um, but there's a couple of reasons why I put this one in and that is one that you can have a look at the days of the week so if you click here and that will open a quick analyze and we can see with this particular system nothing really major um, for some reason Sunday's got a really high strike rate and um, Monday's has as well so one is Sunday two is uh, Monday Wednesday sorry Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday and Saturday um, so you know you've got a couple of days with better strike rates and things like that so it could be argued but the other thing is going back to people who say well it's just variance then on the other hand if you look at a system and averagely it's kind of doing all right over the, the course of those um, seven days then you could argue that it's actually not a bad system because it, it does make profit on most days um, and so overall that you're not seeing any variance so it's not a not a bad system um, this is a, a lay system if I remember rightly yeah, it is a lay system um, and it goes on ch chase and hurdle so you know overall it's not doing bad at all and as I said if we um, add in UK and Ireland um, it's not not that bad either it's come up with a few points every month so those are the um, free updates for PR ratings so we've got green rated 0 to 3 we've got the um, UK and Ireland now and also 
we have um the days of the week so you can you can check that i mean if we have a look at another system quickly uh there's another one in here that's been quite interesting um well actually let's go up to this one because i haven't looked at this one for a bit somebody just put it in a safe file name um but anyway let's have a quick look at this system it's another lay system um and again so it's now this is interesting because this one has had this kind of weird going now as it's a lay system i actually would turn down the actual um prices so let's just say we wouldn't go over um 10 and then we reset that because you i mean unless you're using liability staking you don't really want to start laying it over that so, so you can see it's been a little bit more consistent over time um average about four points not great but not you know it's still profit which you should be looking for on anything um so if we now look at days of the week on that one so you know this is a bit weird because it's got like three days of the, four days of the week that it does really well and three days of the week that it doesn't so you could argue you know there's some variance there and should should you read into that or not so if we were we were get, we would be taking um sunday monday tuesday wednesday thursday and saturday so remember that um so we can go tuesday wednesday thursday and saturday and then if we hit the button to update that we can see how that's affected the method and yeah so it's given us a couple more extra points whether you'd want to believe that or not is obviously up to you but um that's how you could possibly use it um to with a system to see if it's worth using or not anyway that's up to you um i supplied the, the software so you can have a look at things like that and decide on how you want to use um the software the systems you create and where how you know you feel those filters work over time and that kind of thing so that's that's all left up to you to do and um, as i said there's all those shared systems that you can have a look at if you want um so another one would be that flat green's been doing quite well um if we have a quick look at that and we go down so again um This month already, it's done seven points. We're in this. Well, this is the beginning of day three of this month, so that's not been too bad. This has actually got less information in it because of another rating, which I think is oh flat season. Of course, it's only the flat season, so it's only got this um, information. And the rating, I think it's one of the ratings, wouldn't have been available last year. So we've only got one se uh, season to go on. Green rating, of course, zero zero. So. Um, but again, you know, it's, it's looking quite interesting. Um, if we, can we see any difference with UK and Ireland? Let's have a look. That was a bit slow. Mm, I think it's about the same, actually. I don't know, we'll have to have a look into that. Um, what about days of the week? So, no, and overall, it covers them all. Sunday, it doesn't have many selections on a Sunday anyway, so that partly could be that. But um, overall, uh, roughly, you know, the same bit, bit higher percentages on Sundays, but really about the same. So that's how you can use it with PR ratings to figure out um, ways to improve your system or create a system okay i hope you enjoyed that don't forget leave in the comments if you want the um find out more about pr ratings or it does i don't care how you say it, actually <laughs> find more about how about pr ratings and send me the free system either of those two or both of them if you want and i'll be more than happy to send you that information okay thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video Bye bye